Halloween has always been full of horror, but nothing quite as horrifying as a monstrously sized asteroid flying through our planet's orbit. According to NASA and other experts, a huge asteroid is on course to fly right through Earth's orbit on Halloween. Fortunately for us, the asteroid doesn't pose any real threat but what a coincidence. The estimated upper size of the asteroid is just short of the tallest building in the world. NASA predicts that just in time for Halloween, a newly discovered potentially hazardous asteroid nearly the size of the world's tallest skyscraper will pass Earth. The asteroid, which is named 2022 RM4, is thought to have a diameter of between 1,083 and 2,428 feet, 330 and 740 meters, which is just below the height of Dubai's Burj Khalifa, which is the tallest building in the world at 2,716 feet, 828 meters. It will fly by our planet at about 68 times the speed of sound, or 52,500 miles per hour, 84,500 kilometers per hour. On November 1st, the asteroid will come within approximately six times the average distance between Earth and the Moon which is approximately 1.43 million miles, 2.3 million kilometers. This is a very small gap by cosmic standards. Any large body within 4.65 million miles, 7.5 million kilometers, of our planet is considered potentially hazardous, and NASA labels any space object that is within 120 million miles, 193 million kilometers, of Earth as a near-Earth object. Astronomers keep a close eye on these potential threats once they are flagged. Using radar, they look for any deviations from their predicted trajectories that could set them on a devastating collision course with Earth. The Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System, ATLAS, a collection of four telescopes that can scan the entire night sky every 24 hours, is used by NASA to track the locations and orbits of approximately 28,000 asteroids. More than 700 near-Earth asteroids and 66 comets have been spotted by Atlas since it first came online in 2017. Two of the asteroids that Atlas found, 2019 MO and 2018 LA, actually hit Earth. The first one exploded off the southern coast of Puerto Rico, while the second one crashed into the ground close to where Botswana and South Africa meet. Fortunately, those small asteroids did not cause any harm. The trajectories of all near-Earth objects up to the end of the century have been estimated by NASA. According to NASA, the good news is that there is no known threat to Earth from an apocalyptic asteroid collision for at least the next 100 years. However, this does not imply that astronomers should stop looking. Even though most near-Earth objects don't end civilizations, like the comet that destroyed the planet in the 2021 satirical disaster film Don't Look Up, there have been a lot of devastating asteroid impacts in recent history to make it worth keeping an eye out. For instance, in March 2021, a meteor the size of a bowling ball exploded over Vermont with a force equal to 200 kilograms, 440 pounds, of TNT. A meteor that exploded in the atmosphere above the central Russian city of Chelyabinsk in 2013 produced a blast roughly equivalent to 400 to 500 kilotons of TNT or 26 to 33 times that of the Hiroshima bomb. Around 1,500 people were injured when fireballs fell from the sky over the city and its surroundings during the explosion in 2013. Space agencies around the world are already thinking of ways to avoid an asteroid coming our way if astronomers ever spy on it. In the first test of Earth's planetary defense system, the Double Asteroid Redirection Test, DART, Spacecraft rammed the non-hazardous asteroid Dimorphos off course on September 26. This altered the asteroid's orbit by 32 minutes. Additionally, China has indicated that it is beginning to plan an asteroid redirect mission. The nation hopes to prevent the asteroid Bennu from striking Earth in a potentially catastrophic way by launching 23 Long March 5th rockets into the space rock. Between the years 2175 and 2199, the space rock will come within 4.6 million miles, 7.4 million kilometers, of Earth's orbit. Well, that's it for today.
If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comment section. And if you enjoy our content, and never want to miss a video, hit the subscribe button. Thank you for watching.